easiest thing to kind of oh here we go man's is cooking and swerving and boop it was marlo uh oh, marlo i'm gonna give you the pass right now because you did kind of slow down but it was because of traffic my rule of thumb is if you slow down enough from the highway i'll give you the pass you're not perfect oh listen i live and breathe carbs my entire growing up my 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 entire italian life was just carbs but i had to cut back on them typically now whenever like i go over to family's houses and and this is something too to keep in mind if they're doing like pasta and meatballs have a little like a small 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 scoop of pasta and grab like an extra meatball you feel fuller mm, i'll give it the pass every calorie uh every uh every diet is based on calorie deficit yeah it's not one size fits all but it helped me substantially i lost like 90 to 100 pounds on keto i'll be honest one of my favorite meals and i'm gonna call it a meal is i'll buy i'll, I'll make like marinara sauce and i'll make homemade meatballs and I'll literally just have like meatballs and marinara with a little like Parmesan on top. Completely cutting out the pasta sometimes. Not all the time, but sometimes. It, it I, keto, keto genuinely was like a lifesaver for me. Made me a lot more confident. Um, Radio Jig. I don't know. 10 2. 10 2. 176 back down to the city from Sandy Shores. Hey, firm. Be advised. I just had a Wayne Freeman on a bike go by me northbound Ellis Freeway at 118. Uh, he already long gone. <laughs> I need to get back to the gym, though. I need to, I need to start building muscle again. I, I think next time I go shopping, it's going to be all like protein shakes and shit like that because i i think i'm serious about going back to the gym i noticed there's a lot more bikes in shift too they're gonna be there too i'm on the highway to hell the only thing that sucks is that I, I won't be able to do any leg workouts because of my foot. I might be able to do like calf workouts, maybe, but I, and anything that is on my foot is probably going to be a hard pass. Walking, shit like that is out. My pain is actually worse than it was before. This man. Anti-inflammatory has helped my foot, but it, I, I would have to take a pill every single day for it to help. If I stop taking it, it just, it hurts the same it did before. It's not worth it. I'd rather hurt a little bit and know my limits than, you know. Oh, 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 oh. Gray color four door comes back to an even dark. What the fuck is going on? Dispatch coffee. Can I know again? You said gray four, sorry, go ahead. Gray four door comes back to Ethan dark. Uh, westbound Route 68 at the junction in between uh, uh, Route 68 coming out from Bolenbrook. Okay, that vehicle is likely the vehicle that was used in conjunction with the one we arrested on a 37 Charlie run. Ethan Dark is the guy we have in custody. That was the vehicle we were chasing when we found Ethan Dark driving a stolen car. So we can't prove anything, but you should definitely like see what info you can get out of whoever's driving that document who they are like maybe where they go i don't know only had money orders no wash cash so they were likely the ones handing off the wash cash to him um uh oh Ooh. 10 four ah. Dispatch 125 attempting to catch troops with speeding black color tow truck North Ellis Freeway.
Jake goes pulling off on Mount Vinewood Drive, or sorry, excuse me, Vinewood Park Drive. Gonna be in a 38, just off the exit ramp, uh, northbound, exit ramp, Ellis Freeway nearest cross Vinewood Park Drive. Requesting a 77. 19776. Uh, Crane, are you still on radio? You and Bones processed um, Dundee, correct? High action. Okay. Uh, you <laughs> get me, it was, but I don't Again. think the processor saved the process on uh, Dundee for uh, the you know, like, spot, man. Thank you. Man, I'm just trying to stop people from coming, you know, a million well, miles an hour drive, into right? Legion Square. That that's that's it. You know what I'm saying? Like No, no, you got me again. You got me again. Uh, I right. Legion Square, okay? Nah, you're good, dude. Listen. What do you need? Uh just your ID. Reason for stop. Your speed. I'm I was speeding? Oh fuck yeah, you were speeding. Oh fuck. <laughs> I, I, here, let me fix it myself up and I'll give you my. Idea. Yeah, you're good. You're good. Take it down. Thank you, Action. I appreciate there it. I'll, go, dog. I'll, I'll be right back with you, okay? For sure. <laughs> I love when people are like, damn, dog, every time. 2338, Final Park Drive, and LS3 Way. Uh, all right. I love people that are super chill about just being like, yo, you know, I got that shit. I did that. Uh, action caption. Um, I'm going to hit him with second degree. Oh, fuck. What's going on here? Come on. I fucking hate the MDT sometimes. Hey, Declan, how long is Ethan Dark in jail for? Um, We're still talking to his lawyers. I should oh, him. shit, okay. Yeah, these people were asking about... Uh, that's who they're looking for. They're looking to pick I'm going to drop it to second degree for him. Yeah, yeah. Tell, them, uh, tell them he'll be out uh, minus the money order, but, you know, they can do another run with their wash cash. Like being cheeky, right. you know. All right, 10-4. All right, he got a warning last time, so I'm going to get him with the full ticket this time. Uh, if you got unclogged, action caption with... Uh... Okay. Cool. All right. And then we'll do rapid citation. Nice. Oh, actually, I forgot to the. Uh... There we go. Now I can do this. All right. Alrighty, action. What's the damage, man? I'm gonna I'm gonna cut you a little bit of a break. I gave you a warning last time. This time obviously won't be a warning, but I am gonna cut it back. You were speeding in the first degree, which is like a twelve hundred dollar fine. Oh shit, okay. But I'm gonna cut it back for you. Uh I'm gonna personally drop it to second degree. Because okay. you, you've never given me any shit or any issues, which I appreciate. And it is your first citation. So I, okay. I'm, I'm gonna cut you a little bit of a break. But it is gonna be a seven hundred and fifty dollar fine and two points on your license. Um, okay. Do you have any questions about that? You're a gambling man? Am I gambling man? I'm already giving you kind of a break. How big of a gamble are we talking? Uh, what's my options? I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what. Cause it's your first citation. I'll cut you, I'll cut you this. We're, we'll go either big or we'll go low. We're gonna roll okay. a one out of 20. If I roll higher than you, you get first degree. But if you roll lower than me, I'll drop it to third degree, which is a right, $375. Deal, 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 deal. All right, all right, let's brother. Okay, all right, you ready? Yeah, I'll do it here on the side. So all right, all right. Hand over. All right, we're gonna three, two, all one, right, go. go. You ready? 
ready you, you do the countdown right, you do the three countdown. two one go oh shit <laughs> oh it's my lucky day all right okay it's my lucky day give me a minute i'm gonna go and update this congratulations <laughs> appreciate, it. appreciate it dog <laughs> Damn, I'm gonna go to wait is a um, Casino open or yeah, dog. Uh, I don't think the casino is open yet, but they do have that big opening soon thing going on. So maybe uh, Should I I was gonna go spin some shit put some on Nah, wait, you're what's good the popular one eight black eight 28 black, uh, For me eight? for me. It was always 27 uh, red 27 red 27 was always solid for me Never, uh, shit. never fail the 27. If you ever see Benji Ramos, tell him 27's hot. 27 is hot. Okay. Always, always. Hey, right. um, Flop, what's a, what's a fine for the third degree? Uh, you went from, so you went from 1,250 to 750 to 375. Yeah. You worked your okay. ass all the listen, way down. <laughs> Flop, listen, it's okay. You're going to catch me later. Hey, Tell listen, I hope not, man. You know where I sit now. I just got to see you do a little bit better, okay? Do me a favor and send the top of this thing I'm not going to lie. Yeah, last time, you could, I was checking that shit every time I came down. I just didn't think you'd be there again today. <laughs> listen, man, you never know. You never know. Yeah, I got I to gotta take a different route. I do. Listen, even if some people take a different route, so be it. But hey, listen, don't, no, don't, no, don't I'm forget. Good. I'm finding new spots. Down. I appreciate you, brother. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, go ahead and sign the, 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 the bottom of this for me, and I'll go ahead and uh, rip this off. You you can appeal this in 30 days if you want to, uh, but overall, this is just saying that you understand that you're receiving the citation. This way, it's documented, so, it's so you can appeal it within 30 days, okay? For that, uh, what yeah, you got it. You got it, dog. On, uh, right. I'm sure in the future, you're going to cite me for a much bigger stuff. No, so no, no. Listen, as long as you work with me, I'm always willing to work with you, okay? Yeah, but I'm from the hood, man. So I'm eventually going to end up in trouble. You get me? Hey, I, trouble. I, listen, as long as you understand that I have a job to do, I understand that you're going to do so things that I'm not going to agree with. Three. But again, as long as we have an hey, agreement it's, it's that I got to do my job, dark, then we're good. On him. Hell yeah, man. Respect goes both ways. You Absolutely. Good shit. Love to hear it. All right, brother. Yeah, I'm yeah. going to go and get back in my car. This way we're not adding it to the uh, build up behind us, but you'll be free to yep, go. Yep. Okay. No one's I appreciate it, dog. Take care. All right, brother. You take I care. It was his first citation. I let him roll high or low. If he rolled high, I would have dropped it the third. If I rolled high, he would have gotten the first that he should have gotten. <laughs> he won. <laughs> Dispatch 125, clear traffic citation issue back in service. Dispatch 197, same traffic. Second issue, you both back in service at 1600. Um, it's right. 160 UTI on that latest 34. Uh, goal. So 160 tonight. Let's go. you playing instead of 1604. All right, dude. Dispatch went from 1930 respond with Spucci with a motorbike by one time. Dispatch coffee. 876 at 30. First stole my low? What do you mean? I love that shit, dude. I like action. He, he's the good one. I wish I got a server ID. I think action is su such a positive dude. I want to give that man a plus one next time I pull his ass over. How did I not clock him? Oh, this means I'll catch his ass coming down. A twenty three thirty eight. Oh, this motherfucker. Oh, local. No, nope, that's not a local. <laughs> Dude, he, he knew. I don't know who it was, but someone told him that there's a cop watching radar here. <laughs> no doubt. Oh, damn. 
This patch 125 tend to catch up to a uh, salmon in color uh, truck. Things ugly as shit. North End Ellis Freeway. Dispatch coffee. One for one. Thirty-eight. Go for. This was 160, 76 is 10, 11 is over on Arcuja Street. It's just coffee. Go and pull off to the right, just that little cutoff over there. Should be good. <clears throat> Dispatch 125, 1038, North Van Ellis Freeway, water treatment plant. Uh, uh, the ugliest fucking truck I've ever seen requesting a 77. 19776. <laughs> Hello, Flop Dugong, LSPD badge number 125. Could I get some license registration, please? So that's 160, oh, 23, 10, 11, So where's your hair? Just... Oh, <laughs> don't worry about it. Listen, my, my hair. My hair is in another castle. Here you go. Oh, I didn't get that. Oh, shit, I thought I didn't give it to you. No, yeah. you're all good. Uh, really quick, just a heads up, brother. Uh, reason for stop was just your um, your you speed. Thank you. I have to admit, oh. I have Metallica kicked on. I hit it. I full blasted it and stopped paying attention <laughs> to the speed limit. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you know what, Red? I, I appreciate that. I appreciate your honesty. Can I ask who owns the vehicle? Uh, this is actually a Mosley's run. I'm actually taking it big up to Polito to drop it off. That explains the hideous color. I can yep. appreciate it. You want to know how bad this gets? I, I get either Barbie pink. I get a truck that looks like this. In the bottom half is banana peel yellow. The top half is banana banana body cream white. This thing and looks like the color of my banana strawberry smoothie that I get. This this looks like a watermelon hubba bubba. <laughs> It's really bad. It Honestly, is. Like, the, the colors we get from these customers are terrifying. If you had the matching pink below, like on the steps, it would not look as bad. Would, yeah. You would theoretically, theoretically, you would have some Listerine strip on wheels. Over yep. on Honestly, if this wouldn't look half as I bad if it didn't speed. have the giant fuck you tank on the side steps. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like, I, 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 I hate, <laughs> like Cornwood's six. truck. Oh, three I five, think actually. Cornwood's truck would look fucking amazing. Like we've already done it. We've lowered his truck. It looks fucking amazing lowered. It just needs the fucking fuel tanks removed from it. And it looks amazing. I was going to say the fuel tanks just kind of scream like, yeah, small wee wee energy. <laughs> yep. I don't know. Did I don't know how to describe it. The, the good thing though is if somebody has these fucking things, they get stuck on shit, so they can't just climb uh -huh. over anything and everything they want. So yeah, let me take a look at some red. When was the last time I got pulled over? Uh, never. <laughs> You've never gotten a citation. I've never gotten a citation. I've always got a warning. Well, I'm gonna tell you what. Today you're getting a fucking warning, okay? I I'm All not right. I'm not even gonna give you the hassle. Uh, you're fine. I appreciate you pulling over being honest. Just do me a favor. When you're in the city, I'm mainly looking to slow people down that are going through Legion Square. Just make sure that we're doing yeah. 55 through Legion Square. I understand when you I hit was, the highway, you're hitting 90, but just wait till yeah. you, you get to the freeway. I th thought that's where I did start speeding up. Like what, right about pillbox is where I started to give myself a full tilt. So or I, I, or I was actually going faster than before that. I'm going to tell you this much. I sit just before Ellis Freeway, like before the, the where the, the, the tunnel is. Yeah right, yeah, right where old pillbox is. That's usually where I full send it at that yeah, point. Where yeah, yeah. I'm just this. before that though. So I clocked you when yeah. you were still on Strawberry and you went through the intersection and then you started going. So I, you, the clock okay. I had you at was not when you were on the highway. It was when you were... Um, okay, just before, just around the yeah, square around yeah. there, yeah. So, All right, yeah. But you're, you're, you're fine. Just do me a favor. I need you to just slow it down. Okay, 55 until you hit the highway and you're yeah, good. Yeah, I can members, do that. Right? I, I, usually, I usually try to stay about 55 in the city, then highway. If, if it's clear highway or something like that, I'll full send it when there's no one around. Just because some of these things, you have to full send it or they don't fucking get up to, like, they won't shift gear. Yeah, our CVPIs are like that. It has a fifth gear, but sometimes it just fails to find fifth. You want to know how bad my Vigero is? It used to be the best car that everyone was driving. The, the Vigero, mechanics their, the, uh, everyone, the mechanics the, got their hands on it. The and Camaro it style vehicle? Yeah, the, the Vigero ZX okay. the Camaro. I own one. Yeah, I, 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 I own the second one in the city. J, yeah. uh, Jay bought the first Not one. I bought the second Bob. one. What do you mean? It's not yours. Well, see, 
he's a dick half of it is i was gonna say he's a dick <laughs> because he wanted it in his name so i took his car in my name but we're, we're still 50 50. it's a marriage that's I mean, half of my I shit did, I, I mean technically I, I did sell it to flop so it's legally flop owns it hey i rest that i i, I will say this though it's a cool looking car but it did lose yep. its gears and it breaks my heart yep. it still goes like I'm... 200 miles an hour it's fucking crazy uh with a i think i have a 52 turbo in mine and it barely hits 187 and that's if i'm going downhill i think i have an 89 yeah. in mine and it it does work yeah the 89 works uh there was somebody that told me it needs to have like a 79 or something in it really somewhere in that range yeah because if you notice when it tops out it'll go wing, 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 and it's, it's mm. trying to get a gear that's not there it's because the turbo is too big Interesting. and i've noticed that if, and i've noticed that the turbo, turbo is too big in the car it sucks fucking fuel like crazy okay i thought that was just me because i was i just nope. i just I asked feel... this on radio yesterday i said does anyone else feel like we just chew through gas like it is it's, fucking paper it is an immediate notice because i had a 52 in my tow truck and i went from here to Polito. by the time i hit Polito, i had a quarter tick of gas no shit yep. okay I, I ripped it out i put a 31 into it and it took about half a tick of gas i said fuck this rip the, this rip the, the, uh, fuck, rip the turbo completely out of it okay bye dude the the fuck? yeah rip the turbo out of it completely it's, it's oh, just gas again and uh like with my saddler that i'm gonna go get my saddler can hit like 135. Mm -hmm. it's got a 82 in it right now and it feels just about perfect like it's, I, I, it uses a little bit more gas but not too much like you have to find just that right turbo for the car and it will just fucking it'll fly i think okay. when the big tuna i think when big tuna opens up we could actually fix that issue though i'm hoping we can actually dyno the cars and shit and actually fix that because like the the Vigero is an eight speed and then they ch the mechanics change the ecu so what it does is it skips sixth and seventh gear and throws us in eighth gear instead of sixth gear yeah i That's noticed why I that so long it, yeah i was gonna say that the longevity of the, it, it builds at like 140 and then from 140 to about what i see right now is to about 190 takes almost a solid two minutes yep and what, what's insane is there's cars like i can go buy a ballista compact right now Yo, what's up, electric? How are you? for 35 grand i can go buy that car and it will blow the doors off of the girl that's insane Yep, it will, it will literally because uh, I drove chips and chips went so fast. He, his car, his car when I drove it went so fast to get up to speed, it made my head pop three times. <laughs> you gotta be fucking kidding me. <laughs> there, there's, there's cars that are insanely fucking fast and extremely cheap, like the tailgater, not the hmm. tailgater S that I used to own five years ago, but the regular tailgater. Yeah, is it's the Vigero when I first bought the Vigero. There's the and it's it's legit just a forty thousand dollar car. Hmm. So it's like forty or fifty thousand dollars. There's cars that are like really cheap that are extremely fast. Masakro is, is insanely good car, but I think that's like 150 grand, 150 grand or something like that. Do you have your well, semis? For the in price stock? is like that. Uh, semis? Yeah, the the yeah the the, the lower pickup trucks, the Yosemites. Oh, the, 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 the Yosemite. Trucks? I I can check, but I don't think we have the Yosemite. Damn. Okay. But I can I can check. I, that I can was go my first check, truck we, many years ago, and I missed it. Yeah, I remember that truck. Yeah. So that for me. Ooh, hey, there goes a free uh, tow truck. Dude, I know. I keep catching those motherfuckers. That man is so, hauling. Yep. So you want to know what's worse about those guys? Uh, they've been up in Sandy Shores just yoinking local cars nonstop. Well, it's going to hurt them because I'm sitting there at that ramp and they are all out looking for their money yeah. and I'm hitting them with first degree speed. They're, they're getting 50, almost $1,500 citations. You guys could actually go up there. Uh, ooh, that, so... I suggested the Cornwood when he bought the uh, the Guardian. You guys need to buy actual like Saddlers. Like they're 15, like right now they're like 14 yeah. too. Insanely good truck. It's actually a higher rated truck or higher rating than the Car Car, but not your police Car Car. I, I was thinking that thing rock climbing earlier, but you need you guys to get some of those and some of those shitty cars. Just sit up there and watch the tow drivers. Cause I've, I've seen them doing it myself and others have told me about it. Well, I'm, I'm assuming they, they just bump them. No, they're literally just pulling up to cars that are parked at like the gas stations and shit. And they're just marking them, towing them, and, and because all of our spots are up here in Sandy Shores and Polito. So, like, once in a while, we'll get a drop off spot in town. So, they're sitting up here and they're dropping them off at Route 68 at the uh, right here on Harmony. Uh, what is this road right here? Uh, Shit. uh Los Angeles Freeway. It's, it's, yeah, so it's around Route 68, like the, the one drop off on Sonora Road and 68 at the gas hmm. station right there. So, they're dropping there. The other drop-off spot is up in Grapeseed at the uh, farm up there on 
Grapeseed Avenue right there. Uh -huh. So they're dropping there. And then the other spots, Polito, and then the one in town. So the majority of the calls come to the two in either Grapeseed or right here on Sonora Road. I and might what they're start doing is they're just sitting. Okay. Yeah. So now that they're making like five hundred to seven hundred dollars a pop, they're just up there stealing cars left and right. And yeah, that's but bad. Then you got like, yeah, and and they've been and it's such a number of them doing it that like I would have been sending in like government reports level of they're doing it badly up there. And it's just that I'm not awake when they're doing it, or I'm busy down in Mosley's doing shit, so I can just sit up there and catch people doing that shit. It's it's bad bad. That's why when uh, Max said that towing's like two or three times higher than grime and uh, G six, that's hmm. why. Because Holy people are up shit. there just banging that shit out like nonstop, and they're just yeah, they're just banging out money left and right. Because when I do towing, for like since December, dude, I'm learning towing, so much. This, this is good. We got this. ammunition. I lost money every night. I did three. Thank I was you. doing, and this was when I couldn't get parts and repairs because I, I won't get repairs from like. Mary's people, uh, yes, since, they're the, since they're the ones that slit my throat. One sixty. Jesus uh, Christ. Back yeah, because up, I was uh, undercutting people. I was doing five hundred dollar repairs. Oh no, Mary, you're, Mary, you're, you're, Mary you're, crew didn't like that. You're a uh, you're a good person, and they hated that. Yeah. Yep. And <clears throat> so I was buying my parts from Max, paying three hundred and forty dollars a pop for my parts. And I had to get through tow truck repaired three times a night because I was constantly going from town to Polito on my drop offs. So I would start the day with like 3,500 in the bank and I would go to bed with 3,200. Chat tech notes. This is I had huge. to make my money back by working at Senior Buns for 50 receipts and then praying that I don't get robbed. Holy shit. You well, know, then thankfully, since I got the pistol, I don't get robbed at Senior Buns no more when I work there because no one wants to fuck around and find out. I was going to say, no one wants to fuck around and find out. That's huge. No, good shit, man. Well, listen, I don't want to hold up your delivery. Uh, you're good at my book. Just make sure you're slowing down. It's yeah, always I'll a pleasure it. talking to you, Red. I'm gonna throw you my number because I don't think I have your number. But if you ever, uh, yeah, I had your number, but like I said, the whole throat getting slit and then being thrown in the ocean. Yeah, four times. yeah, yeah. This is like my third phone. Get this, Max or uh, yeah, Max Loth actually found my second phone's uh fucking SIM card. No kidding. Okay. They, so oh, they don't get destroyed. Me. That's how me and Dominic actually found 33 bags or 33 weed, weed plants the other night. Holy shit. Because I, cause I knew you guys found me in Polito. So I went up to the little area where you guys found me. We started looking around up the beach up there thinking maybe they threw my SIM card for my first phone up there. Uh -huh. And we found 33 bags, uh, 33 pot plants up there just on the beach, like just off the water in the beach. That's fucking insane. Okay. But yeah, but Max found my fucking second card or phone SIM card right up here at the lighthouse, right off the cliff right there where they throw the cars off the cliff. Yeah. He found it. He found it out in the water out there swimming around. No shit. That's yeah. amazing. Uh, so it would make sense because they don't go bad. I love so, like, Red. I, Red I, I is such man, a good role player. If I get a player, or something, I just this ride man is amazing. I, 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 I love this city, dude. I might be able to find some fucked up shit. Dude, if you just decide to take a day and go drive in inconspicuous spots, I promise you will find a lot of shit. Yeah, that's that's kind of kind of why I want to get my hands on a guardian like a Cordwood's got because there's that beach down on the southeast side of the island there. Oh, and it, you need yeah, you need something that's you, tall enough so you don't waterlog. Don't, yep. And then so you're there. In Cornwood's, in Cornwood's truck is perfect because I can do that because I used to all the time with the uh, semi truck and it's got the grip. So I might actually drive out there and just walk around there and shit or even on a BMX and going around on a mountain bike and doing a mountain bike. Because uh, I mean, I am trying to get into PD and this just helps me out with like my resume here. Is what uh, constantly selfish what shit, shit did you apply for? Uh, so I only applied for shift two, okay. but I should have actually applied for shift one and shift two and mm. three because I usually wake up at Tsunami and then I go to bed at around 6 a.m. But since I'm just doing what I'm doing now, I get insanely bored and I fall mm. asleep behind the wheel. So I go to bed at Tsunami. <laughs> no, I, I, I don't, I don't so, blame you. Uh, yeah. I'll, uh, I'll tell you what, not, don't, don't hold me to any promise, but have you gotten a call back from anybody about your application? Uh, no, so I applied, I was like, I told people I was like one of the first 10 or hundred people to apply in December, like the very first week. We have a new I application. Was there, I was there night two. Yeah, so I put a new application in. I can actually look that up on my phone here. Okay. I put a new application in. Let's see, where is the text? Uh, who is it? It was Jordan, I believe, that gave me it. Okay. So, George, yeah, so a shift to Jordan one exactly one month ago, according to my phone. Let me. So it's been 30, 30, 30 days ago. I paid the 2400 and everything. Okay. Let me. 
Yeah, because I've been wanting I'll to do ride alongs you. and everything. Yeah, because I've been wanting to do ride alongs and everything. I'm like, I mean, Corn would give me some ride alongs. I need to do something. I need to get the fuck out of that place instead of selling cars. Yeah, let me. I'm gonna reach out to somebody and put in a vouch for you for whatever shift you're applying for because I I think you're yeah. you've always had a good head on your shoulders for the years that I've known you, Red, and you you have given me no reason to I guess have any distrust in you. In fact. You're one of the most reliable sources we have when it comes to 911 calls. And whenever I need a statement, I can always rely on it. Even if yeah. it's not me taking it, someone else is. And you always, you're, you're, you're through and through, man. Yeah. It's, it's mostly because I used to be a cop. Like I was about to say, you can come over, Mabel. I'm ago. sorry. Okay, I'll, I'll, let me hop out real quick. I heard, I heard no, applications. You're good. Yeah. What shift? Yeah. Uh, this shift, actually. So basically all three, technically all three shifts. If I, if I could stay awake long enough, 16 hours, I'd be in a little bit of all three. Well, you need a you need a primary shift, right? So yeah, pri my primary would be shift two, yeah. Okay, because so, I know Cause that I... shift two gets pretty fucking down bad. It's always been like that for years. Like shift two always gets down bad. So, I mean, it's it's definitely a shift. Um, because yeah. I'm I'm the PNT coordinator for shift two. Yeah. Oh, are you? Re Wait, um, shit, really? Yeah. I was Damn. I was always the guy five years ago so, during shift two that was always oh hey here's Red being kidnapped yeah. again. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, I I. I I don't have a lot of power when it comes to hiring people, but I am the coordinator when it comes to taking care of cadets, and PPOs, and all that fun stuff. Yeah. Uh, essentially, I think the best way to put it is like lead FTO, I guess, in shift two. Um, so if if you did apply there, I can have a word because it is mainly high command who's yeah. dealing with hirings and and picking and choosing everybody. And I don't know if you said you put in an application recently yeah, with the new literally, like, literally a month, cost? yeah, exactly a month ago. Okay. Yeah, um, I paid, paid twenty five hundred and put the app in there and everything. Dude, Red is so good, man. There was another tow truck using his yeah. lights. He's not supposed to. Yeah, so um, the other worst uh, thing is Pred even warned me about it. Apparently, the Manor are doing towing now, and if you piss them off, they actually show up like five dudes deep and rob you if you're another tow driver and shit. Holy That's shit! Okay, yeah, so the so the so they're, hard man. Yeah, they're 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 the ones that have been doing the booting shit. Illegally mm. booting cars. They're not. Like, yeah, that's a crime. Them. If you if you get yeah. that, you can. Report oh yeah, no, that. they're. Uh, I forget what the actually see them doing. They're, they, so you guys Illegal need to call. Use of towing yep. Hmm. So you guys literally need to call. Like if I'm towing and I have a boot, you need to call me to come and put a boot on a car. Or if I'm at Mosley's and then me and the other Mosley guys say, oh, guys are working there and say, hey, this car's been in here for a while. Let's call in a boot. We could hmm. call in a boot on the government property or on private property. You can boot the car, then have it towed. These guys are legitimately say you pull your you're, you're in the bank. They're they're jumping out of the fucking truck. Yeah. Red's just got good like get out of the car. dad energy. You know. Alexander, I don't know how to describe it. He's just, he's just a positive boot. dude. That's and the one wild. the one guy did so the one this guy in front of senior buns rammed my Camaro right up onto the uh yeah, he, he drove by, slammed it from the backside. I know he did it because my back one my tail lights were shattered. Bones, what did that guy plead? Not guilty and requested lawyers. Hey, firm. Copy that. It's the whole thing. He pulls up, runs up to my car, and dude just uh, does the shit. I'm like, yeah, no, I'm not fucking dumb. I know that tactic. I know people that used to do it constantly because I used to do the same tactic, but I wouldn't do the ramming shit. I pull up, see if the car's illegal, do a loop, come back. If the car's still there, yoink their shit. These guys are intentionally ramming the cars. And then I sent, or I think I sent a photo of it. I did. I sent a photo of it to uh, to the mayor because uh, Max was there as well. I shit you not. Let me find the text oh. here. I'm like, hey, Max. Uh, here it is. Uh, I sent a photo two days ago. Hey, Max, it's red. Uh, then I sent him the text the photo of the same tow driver that I, pay, I paid him $1,000 to tell Carmine's car that was literally parked because that was fucking hilarious there. But this photo shows two dudes in cars. I kind of want red in the PD. In the parking lot in rental cars. The thing and though, the other tow guy, the tow guy here, walking this? up and marking the car. I'm like, I hey, want a uh, lot of people in the PD, earlier, but I also think that people like red like are such, such a pleasure as, as civilians to run into. And uh, I'm like, yeah, he's doing that. And Max is like, yeah, that's a. You know what I'm if, saying? If you catch him recording, uh, like a video recording, doing that, it'd be great. Do you, you know, have a camera? Uh, constantly. I don't. It's on my phone. There's not much life on it left. I found it on the ground, but. You ever oh, see? Oh yeah, I've, I, I found one of these too. I wasn't sure if I had to be signed in as like a fucking news reporter or not. Yeah, I just found it on the ground. I said fuck it, so yeah. I took it. But if you, uh, you know, if you ever see anything, feel free to record on it. Yeah, yeah we'll do. <laughs> also, something I always find funny is you know how our phones are supposed, or not our phones, our state ADs here, that are supposed to expire in 2024. Yeah. Uh -huh. 
It's 2028. Our, our shit expired four years ago. I know. I know. I, I it's, we, yeah. no, we, it's no, five years ago. It expired in 2020 because it's 2029. It's funny. expired five years ago. We uh, I just fucking understand anymore, we, man. We I made all of our computers still say 2024 and shit, too. Yeah. We made a point in the meeting. I said the first person to tell me if it's 2024 or 2028, so I know if someone's got an expired license, gets a dollar. Because <laughs> because we all have said the same thing. We're like, is it is it 24 or is it 28? I've lost track of time. We've been away from this island so I long. Just, but, don't so question I've been, it. I, I've been confused weird. on it because I'm like, wait a minute, was it 2018 when everyone left or what? So I've confused myself. I'm like, are we in a time bubble? Yep, we are. We're like That's in Disney time. where we're like, um, we're Disney, you know, people we're believe that. We're, we're in the Simpsons where it's always the same year. Yeah, it, it's, yeah, it's like Disney where people think that like we just turn the weather on and off. Yep. Every yeah, five years, every uh, five years, Homer just changes what he did as a teenager. <laughs> Yeah, we have, um, so I'll, I'll see if I can talk to, like, Bones, McElty, maybe York. Um, yeah, because I think, to... I think I know a lot of people, like, in my head, I, I know stuff. the reason a lot of people are probably worried about hiring me is because of the outfit. But I don't think a lot of people understand that I actually have three outfits. I have an LSPD. I have a San Andreas, like, I, I have the, because I used to wear them. Flops see me wearing the outfits. Hmm. But is it, do, I, is it this LSPD? Not this exact one, but it's the OG LSPD. So yeah, it's so it's mm. it's the LA it's Noir. It's no, yeah. it's the LA Noir fucking fifties PD outfit. Full yeah, outfit. yeah. And it's it's the one that I've always had. I mean, but to I be also, fair, Cornwood Cornwood had a yeah. sheriff's office, and I was gonna say know, Cornwood actually. was sheriff so for the first I, two months. So let's let's yeah, be yeah. let's be honest. I also yeah. I also have a, a G six uniform that is that could technically be changed just enough like if i got a tailor just put sheriff on the uh body armor and it's literally a sheriff uniform just slightly mm. off color yeah and um, uh if it ever came which was my end goal is fucking bike trooper i've actually got the bike the uh, trooper outfit for bike no shit okay i cool. have an sahp uh, uniform yeah but i've also been working on it uh at home uh after i go to the apartment i've been working on police deliveries i've, I've been wanting to submit them to the fucking government really I have Fuck I have yeah. a sheriff livery, I have an LSPD livery, and I have a uh, SAHP livery, trooper livery. That's so cool. Um, yeah, I'll, the trooper I'll see one I kind of want to redo though, but because yeah, it's kind of cool, it kind of works like how yours is. Now. <laughs> <laughs> I can tell Red's passionate. The entire car is painted black, and then it's the police livery is cut out, so you can actually have like your primary paint underneath it. What I did is I've got something similar where it says. Uh, Red's so Police passionate, Santos he's good. Like this, but it's got a yellow stripe that goes like underneath the mirror and it comes and curves down. But then the rest of the doors are just left cut out and there's nothing around it either. So you can still paint the car black and white, blue, whatever the fuck you want to paint it. Mm. And and then you still, and then the livery will be like black and yellow. And it can be even a ghost livery. Like you can go full black on the car. You'll still be able to see where it says police on the side of the vehicle with like a white, like a yellow I stripe. I wish we had ghost cars. I think it would look so cool. Soon TM. Uh, Soon I've, TM. I've actually, I've actually figured out how to fix the issue to where if you actually went black on black. So when you go black on black on this, does the police Los Santos look weird to you? It used to. Doesn't like, anymore. Like, like it would have like now, my now, uncle now, with now the passionate. primary color is the black, so we can change that so, to any color. Yeah, so, if you, so in your secondary is what changes your police, right? I don't think it does. I'm going to make a phone call real quick. So I actually, like, I actually found out what was causing that issue uh, when I was working on liveries. I actually know how to Howdy. Howdy. So I, I got something for you. Okay. Not physical, but something that we talked about yesterday. Remember yesterday I asked, I said, does anyone else feel like they just chew through gas? I pull, I have red pulled over right now. We've been talking for probably the last 45 minutes to be honest. Cause yeah. he, he, we, we've just been going back and forth, but red was saying that he noticed that he would drive from the city to Polito with like an uh -huh. 89 and would have a quarter tank of gas. And what he did was he put a 31 in his car in Polito and drove back down after refilling and had about half a tank of gas. Huh. So he thinks that so. there is a relation to the size of turbo, to the power used on the engine, relating to how much your MPGs drops. Oh shit. Okay. I never thought about that, but after Red explained it, it made sense. It was like, it was like a weird puzzle that I was just missing, but it, it, it actually makes complete sense. Yeah, I uh, 
I thought that maybe that could have something to do with it, but I'll be honest with you. Mm-hmm. I kind of, I was like, no, that would be ridiculous. And I just kind of like threw, threw that idea in the trash. So Red maybe right. That, that was accurate. I don't know. Cause we were both talking about the, the Vigero. I bought one of those Vigero, whatever the hell they're called. The, the like Camaro style vehicle. Cause I yeah. had one. We were talking about how the car has changed. I said, yeah, I have an 89 in mine right now. And I think it's really good. He said, yeah, I took the 89 or he, he took his larger one out and put a 50 something in it. Cause he noticed that the 50 something uh, was not as much of a gas guzzler. And he said it was, it wasn't even like a matter of question. It was just a matter of trial and error. And it, it showed consistently. Right. Okay. I see what you're saying. Very interesting though. I, I wanted to pass it along to you cause I know that you're, you know, but simply. Yeah. Yeah. No, that's good to know. The car I mean, guy. I don't know. Yeah. I don't know if it like, hmm. I don't know if that changes how we do anything. Cause I, hmm. it doesn't change how we do anything, but red believes that there is a fine tuned method to getting the best performance while also maintaining the best MPG. Yeah. And let's be honest. How long is our average pursuit? Would you say 10 minutes? Uh, average pursuit? I, th I think they're getting longer. They're definitely like, getting longer. They're, they're, they're gonna getting get... like to 15 and 20 minutes. Like, I, I had to call one off today. Because I'm like, guys, this is getting way the hell too long. Yeah, it, it's going to happen. Sure Sometimes if you get the primary the suspect and maybe the on. pickup driver or some shit, Dude, sometimes it's worth just saying, hey, fuck the, the third car. Let's just move on. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, and I mean, like, if it's like 20, 20 25 minutes, I'm like, okay, yo. Like, this is if over. we don't this catch him by that point, like, look, you know, we, we didn't do our jobs. Absolutely. As long as they don't, like, reset the, you know what I mean? If they, if they escalate and they, they take it to the next step. Dispatch 125, then, it, then it's, like, then it's like, okay, we got to we gotta reset. Say that last part again, sorry. Oh, well, did like, you want a 77 down there with you? Uh, I'll just have a look. I'll be fine for now. Like, I think that we should have, like, uh, you, you kind of have, like, a like a time in your head, and then as long as they're not doing something to escalate it, talking car swaps, talking, you know, interference vehicles, all that, because if they start bringing in more and more shit, then it, like, resets that timer. Yeah. You know? My, my rule of thumb is if the pursuit feels like it's going on too long, I think I have a good judgment to state that if it's going on too long, it's probably it just going on too long. On me. Right. You know now, I mean? if, if they're not if they're not doing no crazy shit like a swap, hey, like they're not doing a swap, they're not having interference vehicles come in, and they're, and they're we're just chasing them for like 25 oh, what's minutes. Your, what's your turning then that, to me, uh, that's an issue uh, of like it's not an issue. It's just like it's a situation oh, no, where we're like, like right hi, the, uh, this shit is over, now. you know. Well, they, they, we open up PBS, we, we, we try and stop them, right? And we around, go from so. there. But it, it, it yeah. does... Here, hold on, give me one second. Uh, Maple, I will catch up with you in just a second, right? I'll give you a call. I don't have nothing to talk about. I just want to make sure that you're... Oh, yeah, no, I'm, I'm, I'm all good, brother. I appreciate it. Thank you. All right, sounds good. Sorry. Um, But, yeah, I think uh, I think you're right. I, I, I think we open up PBS, and as we go, we try and maintain our aggression as best as we can, and we go from there. Radio signal's bad over here. Right now, yeah. Nothing else. But yeah, I mean, I think we're all good. If, if you're not getting any testing with the turbo, let me know. I'm curious to know like how big the effect is if you ever want to like test it and try it. Yeah. Okay. Alrighty, I'll talk to you later, Flop. Alright, brother. Talk to you soon. Later. Right. Bye. Cool. Sorry, one two five was on the phone. Uh, was there an active on radio? Negative. Just so. Copy that. You still need additionals down there, or are you should get negative, negative. Should be there. good. Um, All right. Yeah, I was shaking it out. To see Sorry, dudes. I know that was kind of a long conversation, but I love Red, man. Red is, Red is so good, dude. second I flop hey bones uh, I'm gonna throw this out there for I, I again I hold no weight to this I just pulled over a red Harrington 
uh, I had a really nice conversation with him and I guess he applied to PD about a month ago uh, and I asked mm -hmm. what shift he applied for. He said shift two, and I wanted to just yeah, let I've you know. I've already talked to him today. Oh, did you? Okay, okay. I had no idea you guys yeah. talked. I wanted to give you my vouch for him. But... Yeah. I don't pick people, unfortunately. I just interview them and do all the other work. No, that's fine. That's fine. I'm just, I was giving you my, my, my verbal vouch on it. I didn't know how that went for shift two. I, I know everybody does their, their shit differently, but. Yeah, I appreciate it. Yep, all good, brother. See ya. Have What's up, brother? Oh, my brother. 31 Bravo code. Sorry? Oh, I don't have eyes oh. on anything. They must have already left. <clears throat> Alright. Copy that. Dispatch 160, 10-8. Dispatch 20, turn you back in the service at 2106. Alright! Dispatch 103 and 178. Taking out a couple places in Polito with some drug sales. Dispatch copy. 178, be advised. I uh, just got out of a traffic stop with Red Harrington, and he stated that there's a lot of tow up in Polito right now that are just towing legal cars as well. If you happen to not see any 34s, keep an eye out for, for tow trucks. Yeah, I don't, I don't see any activity here, so we'll probably code six for that. I've observed the same, by the way. The other day, I got in an argument with a guy in Sandy because I was like, why are you towing a car off of a house lot? And he said, oh, it's abandoned. And we got a discussion about private property, so 10-4. Hey, firm. Hey, Declan, the, uh, I've been paying attention to Polito and Sandy for a minute now, and I, I don't think I've seen any drug sales in a while. I They're think older, much, I think. Yeah, I think pretty much everything's on uh, down south right now. Cool. All right. Well, what we're talking about before, we're talking about fucking road tripping and shit. I don't know. Um, 100, one, or 160, 100 direct. Give me one second. Let me check something real quick. There we go. All right. You want to just uh, control the area of... Damn, that, that, that motherfucking car don't even go over the speed limit. Details. Linton, you yeah, get the pass. Two. You're actually doing the speed limit. All right, it's uh, 25 at the Strawberry gas station. We'll just roll around and then we'll talk about it. It's funny. Um, Red and Flop have known each other for years, but I think Red would be a good candidate for PD. That's I just, my whole late. thing with a lot of characters, like there's a lot of characters who I interact with, who I love to interact with. Um, most people I, I absolutely just love to, to kind of have RP with. My thing with people like red or people that i like interacting with is as much as i would love to see red in the pd i also think that characters like red in a pullover or an interaction on a scene from a civ pov are so fun to interact with i think they're phenomenal and i think you need people like red uh to keep things healthy Granted, I say that Red's also been trying to apply for PD for a while, and I think that he would be a phenomenal pick. <clears throat> but what were we talking about before? We were talking about road tripping and snacks and shit. What's the longest road trip you guys have been on? I think the longest I did was New York to Florida, and I want to say that was an 18-hour drive, and I think we we did it in one shot. Ooh, who am I pulling over? Who this? A truck. It's red. <laughs> red! That's 197 refuel, <laughs> I'm gonna give him a pass. I think he realized. 2150. One for one, same truck. 18 hours, five hours. Two and a half days across Australia, East Coast. It takes that long. Well, actually, it would make sense. I was gonna say, I feel like it shouldn't take that long to cross Australia, but no, that actually makes complete sense because. Don't you say coastal in Australia, or do you typically veer away from the coast? Throw your hands in the air. You know what I want to listen to? Hold on. I've listened to Wu-Tang Clan. I've listened to Wu-Tang Clan forever. 
party Mostly coastal. I feel like if you're going coastal, it's going to take a lot longer. Dispatch copy. Can I ask a dumb question? Does Australia have like a major highway that goes across the coast? Or do you guys just drive through like cities most of the time? One for one, I'll come back up. Like, do you, do you guys have interstates? Dispatch, when was the uh, last time we had a 34 call over in Jamestown? You do? Okay. Sure. Every mile in uh, inland, the spiders grow one centimeter in size. Is that like a cheesy fact? Like, is that real or is that just a joke? Because I, I, I would be more in line to believe that. But if anything, we can probably back up Fudge Lane and just show some presence as well. Tempo I think that sounds good. 11 I'm gonna be on the northeasternmost mountain because uh, that sounds like a fun fact that could actually be true look and see if there's anyone inside that I can get photos of oh, Tempo, are you trying to investigate it okay so copy that. Okay. not true shit yeah, we'll back off then it's a derb wouldn't be surprised it sounds like it would uh, Cormor, be the next real we get, it's on fudge lane we'll just go and show presence there the m1 is the stop. longest road it goes pretty much around the mainland really okay let's see hold on Highway one in Australia. That's crazy. Okay, cool. That's actually kind of sick. Oh, 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 no, he learned. That That is really cool. I don't know where I'm visiting, man. I, I gotta get my fucking, I gotta get my passport. At some point I wanna start traveling. I'm still looking at buying a truck though, so I'm trying to I'm trying to weigh out my options. It's not that I'm trying to buy the truck; it's that I need the truck because, or I, not even that I need, I need the truck. I need a vehicle because my car is starting to shit the bed. Come to Melbourne. Has the longest straight track without a turn, because yeah, it's like missing civilization. Yeah, uh, could we have someone on the southern side, please? What kind of vehicle do you want? I know exactly, I know exactly which vehicle I'd be getting. I'm looking at a Nissan Frontier Pro 4X Aha Storm. What's the uh, 20 you need someone on the south side, Bay? Petroleum. On the southern side. Oh, fuck. Hold on. What is he? Hello? Okay. Sorry. Dispatch 12538 South Strawberry underneath Olympic by the Strawberry gas station, black and color tow truck. Dispatch copy. We'll go back to my truck in a second. Hello, how you doing? Yo, doing great. How are you? Doing all right. Flop to gong LSPD badge 125. Could I get some license registration, please? Yes, you We're can. Good. Thank you. Race for stop at your speed. Why are we going so fast? Um, uh, 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 I'm in a hurry. Okay. All right. I appreciate your honesty. It's time, time is money. Time is money, I get it, but you, you know what else is money? The lives of people that would be lost if you got into an accident and doing as fast as you were going. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, yeah. Can you guys get that plate for, I appreciate uh, your honesty. Uh, I appreciate the apology. I'm going to go run your info. Have you been pulled over before? Uh, yeah. Maybe okay. Maybe once or maybe twice. Okay. Show 176 okay. to form drive for that drug sale. Uh, could you take off your master or your, your helmet real quick just so I can confirm the face on your ID? Yeah. And then you can put it right back on. Call those CTL. Let's figure out to that. 141. <laughs> a mask under a mask? You mind taking the mask off real quick? 
<laughs> yeah, sorry. sorry. It's okay. Yeah, that's crazy. Uh, that's crazy. All right. So You're all I'm good. Trying to be cool and yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Anyway. okay. All right. I'll be right back with you, Mr. Collins. Is this your truck? It's just coffee. Yes. All right. All right. For one, I think because of the speeding vehicle stop on Poplar Street. Let's see. I like the song. Trey Collins. Ooh. <laughs> that's a. That's a good one. One for one here. Seventy-seven. Uh, westbound, watch below Florida. We got a green card club coming back ten sixty. Through. Just clearing out my apartment block real quick. One nine seven seventy-six. Ten on the twenty six. I believe you said El Rancho Boulevard. Come on, you side, motherfucker. <laughs> I appreciate it. No problem. Oh, oh, I'll shit. Him if I have to. Oh, God, Undertaker? <laughs> Damn right. <laughs> Man, this fucking server is crazy. Uh, 197, same traffic. Uh, uh, all right. One eleven, I'll be sitting on Crescent to. All righty, Trey. I'm going to cut you a little bit of a break today, okay? Uh, I did clock okay. you, but uh, I'm going to drop it a little bit. You did also run the two red lights. I'm going to go ahead and drop those. So instead of there being a couple more points attached, I'm just going to hit you with the second degree speeding. It's still a $750 citation with two points, but it's not over the $1,500 it was going to be, so... Yeah, yeah. Okay. Thank you very much. I got you, Mr. Collins. You can just sign the top for me. Bottom copy is going to be uh, yours. Top copy is going to be mine. Not an admission to get to say that you're receiving the citation. Okay. Also, you have the best Boom. profile picture I've seen uh, by far. That shit's crazy. That shit beats timeless, man. It's a good one. That guy, that guy, he pitted me at 100 miles an hour and then he took a photo like that. I think he's crazy. Well, good news. But he's no, he's good. uh he he's no longer working for the department. So, really? Oh, thank God. Yeah. I've been praying on his downfall since. Can we rush that latest? Oh, he got his downfall. Yeah. That's for sure. Um. Yes. <laughs> anyway, Trey, you're gonna be good to go, brother. All right. Uh, Just slow it down a little bit. Yo. 55. Stop and go yeah, at red lights. Appreciate it, brother. Good one, my man. Just coffee. Same traffic. Dispatch 125, clear traffic, citation issued. Are 77 still needed for the 60 vehicle? Don't believe so. Copy that. Super humid here too. Dude, Australia is just hot. Your guys' this summer is like my fun spring. Damn. You know what? I'm actually going to go help out. I'm going to go hover. We'll get out of the office a little bit, out of the, the traffic citations. Ooh! Jesus. Oh! I love this song! Nose had a party.
We'll keep it rocking. I hope this guy's raw 